Well, hey, Taurus. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. If you guys are new, hello, I am Yasmin. If you have not already, please like and subscribe. So Taurus, we're going to go ahead and get started with your reading. Here we have the uh, this Oracle deck. I never know how to pronounce her name. I just really like this deck. And we're going to also go ahead and clarify with the Tarot. So let's get it. This is going to be for Taurus. Ooh, okay, <laughs> these cards are popping out everywhere. Taurus, you guys are excited about something. Okay, here at the bottom, I mean, I keep saying at the bottom. Here at the bottom is change. We're going to get to it in a minute. Yeah, oh, endings and, and beginnings, right? So weird that these two cards. Let me get it together. Yes, me. These two cards are the same. You guys have faced an ending. It says, I know endings are painful, but it's best that we move on for now. Okay. For now, you know, things have ended. Um, we have another card. I was looking to see which one would. Yeah, not for you. Let's not continue this madness. It's best if we just move on. This could have already happened for some of you. Um, for others, this could be something that will happen in the future. Um, I feel, uh, you know, something needs to, to end in order for something good to, for something better, actually, for something better to come in. Now, here I see contemplation. Here it says, I've been thinking a lot about us. Tell me, do you think of me too? So I feel like, you know, something has ended and, you know, this is a lot of thinking, that type of thing. And then I have perfect match. You know, there's two different situations here. I know a lot of you guys want it to be a particular person, but I see two different situations. I feel like for some, you know, um, things had to have ended with someone because they were not ready. It, the time wasn't ready. You know, you guys are still thinking about each other. Some of you guys are going to be dating in between. And then for others, this will come back together eventually. But what I'm saying that right now, there is going to be a pause um, and you guys are going to go out and date. You could meet your perfect match, which would be another person. Um, you know, that's what I'm saying. But perfect match is here. What does it say? It says we are perfect. <laughs> Reasons. It says reason why our fire is the reason why our fire burns so hot. So I really do feel that for some, this is going to end up being someone that they knew from the past. This could already have been. And you guys are kind of, you know, thinking about um, this person. Maybe they're starting to reenter into your life. But I really do feel like for a lot of you guys, this is over with and done for right now. It's not meant for you, but you do have something better coming in here. And this is part of the change. It says, your love has transformed me. I'm forever changed. Now, you're experiencing change, right? But I also feel like the person that you guys were dealing with experienced change. Okay? So it could be either to be with you or not. I mean, seriously, I see both situations here. I really, really do. I see both scenarios. So let's go ahead. Let's get some more. This is going to be for Taurus. Oh, yeah. Separation. A lot of separation endings kind of theme here. And I may actually do a part two. So look out for that because the, all the Virgos, Capricorn, and Sag be loving that. So I may actually do it if I have time. Separation and then obsession. A lot of thinking. Let's read this. It says, I had to walk away to find what I deserve. Yeah, that's what I said. For some of you, this is going to be you still dealing with someone that you guys knew. But then for others, this is talking about finding someone who's meant for you, who's who's going to give you what you deserve. Here with obsession, I am obsessed with you and our memories. It's almost killing me. That's that contemplation. You know, at the bottom of the deck, what does it say? Forgiveness. Someone is going to be asking for forgiveness. I'm willing, I'm willing to forgive you and let the past go. Ooh. Okay. Now you see how this is two different me, two different situations. Why? Because this is a general reading and not and, and it's not going to fit everyone. That's why I love these readings because it's going to be either or. But what's the end here? A perfect match. So let's go ahead. Let's get um, the well, the other two, and then we're going to clarify. This is going to be. I think that they. I think that someone had another person. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, this person was playing games. 
and then detached here. Oof. It says, I'm emotionally closed off, so I don't feel my past wounds. So somebody in general is just, oh, ego, ego playing games. They're in denial. And then it's unfortunate because it's going to hit this person too late. That's what I'm saying. Once you walk away, you know, yeah, they're, they're going to be obsessively thinking about you and, and this connection and um, about what they missed. And this is what's so sad. But the truth be told is, is that you're going to get your person. So we're going to find out who that is. We're going to clarify that with these cards here. Let's clarify ending. Some of you guys are in a in a marriage or a long-term committed relationship where you're unsure if it's completely over with because you are separated and because you guys have gone through this, you know, dealing with someone playing games and detached energy, whether it's you or your person, and you guys can't do anything but just think about, you know, what this what this the future has for you or what it's holding, you know, what's in store. Look at this death card. A lot of endings. Some of you guys are dealing with a Scorpio. Why is it ending? Here with the Five of Swords, playing games. There it is right there. Mind games. This is a lot of sabotaging energy too. Let's get not for you, Taurus. This person is um, not developed yet. Yeah, still toxic. Even though they're going to try to uh, come in here soon, or maybe it's just a little conversation, they'll come back in, but it's still not going to be right. Obsession. Look at this. Obsession. Obsession. Addiction. They're addicted to you. They can't stop thinking about you. But they just, they're, they're going to have to grow. They're going to have to grow. But that's part of that change that we saw, right? Maybe this could be this type of relationship where it, it really will change them. But it may be too late to be with you, though, because you're, you're trying to move on. Remember, you know your worth. Let's get contemplation. Yeah, here contemplation. I feel like there somebody is very optimistic about the future. And, it's, and if you're not, you should be. This is what I'm saying. Okay. Because there's going to be some good news or some good things that are going to happen to you in the future here. Perfect match. I feel soulmate twin flame energy. We see it with the 111 or not with the 111, with the 1111, with the uh, four of wands. And then we see it here with the perfect match. So someone is in denial. Perfect match. Oh, yeah. This because your perfect match is coming in. It, it's slow. You know, you may have been waiting. It's slow, but it's coming in. We see it here at the bottom of the deck. Sun card. Mm -hmm. Someone's seeing you or watching you. But whatever this is that's coming in here is going to be like a healing. Let's get separation. Yeah, this is having enough confidence to move on truthfully from the past for some of you from a soulmate you're separated from your soulmate this person is going to want another opportunity though but I feel like the start the timing it's just something about the timing that I feel the stars has to align right and that's why it's not working let's get obsession oh two came out okay yeah, and it's like someone is, they're dealing with other people. I think that's what I was saying before. Um, and it's a lot of confusion because somebody doesn't know what they want. You're waiting and then they could be dealing with other people. They're uncertain. There's a lot of things here. Mm hmm This person isn't awakened to this connection yet, unfortunately. Let's get the playing games. They're not... For some of them, it may be too late. Yeah. This person likes attention. This person loves attention. But I feel like this person eventually, somewhere in the future, may want to work on this. But to me, this is more so This need, they need to work on themselves. They're going to have to work on themselves. I'm sorry. Like this person is very egotistical. Ha, ah, egotistical. You can see it with these two cards, but I mean, it's right here. It's just obvious. 
Some things they're going to have to sacrifice. Perfect. I'm glad that this came out. They're going to have to sacrifice because they're extremely superficial. Everything they do is very secretive. Okay. I do feel like they are very immature. And again, they may, you know, be restricted because they're in another relationship or something like that. But right now, it's not just about that other relationship or them dealing with other people. It, I feel like they're not ready yet. You know, that's what I'm saying. Let's get the detached for Taurus. Yeah, this tried to come out. Someone is stuck. Like in their mind, like they're just not, it's just not, they're not, they're not mature enough, but they have a lot of regrets here with the five of cups, but eventually, eventually someone's going to figure something out here with the ace of swords. They better hurry up though, because if not, you're going to get your person. Remember we saw the sun. So I, and it's that sun. Remember it was clear. Oh, it's funny. The sun is here. I wasn't even thinking about it. Somebody's going to figure it out because if they do not, you will cut them away and then your person is going to come in here. They got a, they got a chance though for this to work. Guys, please look out for part two. I think I may do it. Part two, we're, we'll go into the cards a little bit deeper um, just to see what's going on. But that's, you know, just, but just don't come for me if I don't. Okay. Cause I got a lot of other readings, but I haven't done one for you. Uh, but just look out for it. If you guys are interested in a person reading, all the information is inside the description box. Um, again, if you guys are new, please like and subscribe. And Taurus, I love you guys. I'll see you guys back here again soon. Bye, guys.